What is up guys, your Riddles from Boy Kagi, back at it again with a new video and in this video I bring you legendary heroes unchained. In this game you will assemble a team of heroes to explore a procedural generated dungeon route where you will face encounters with enemies in a turn based card style RPG format. You will also face decisions that can apply buffs or debuffs along the way. The ultimate goal is to complete a dungeon run before you expense all of your energy. Decisions and combat reward players with event points, which determines the champion of legendary heroes on chain. Now, before we get started, you should know that this video is sponsored by Legendary Heroes on Chain. Now, we also want to go into the team so you guys can see what kind of veterans we're dealing with here. As you can see, the team is composed of a lot of veterans. This is a massive, massive team. These people are not playing around they have done multiple games as you can see and some of these games have millions of downloads if we just click on this one right here and we go to google you can see 5 million downloads they have been around the block they know what they're doing this is a serious team and i'm glad i'm doing a video for this game because we need industry veterans here that believe in web 3 that know what they're doing and they know how to deliver a product that wasn't enough they have raised 46 million dollars for network studios composed of a team of industry veterans who have made games for ea double fine disney marvel zynga activation and more network studios is bringing their expertise in making deep social hero collecting games to the blockchain now with that being said let's jump right into the game if you guys want to play this game go to the link in the description and make sure you play it quickly because the alpha is closing very soon now let's break down this game real quick right here on the left side you're gonna have heroes and you're gonna start with this five heroes in the future of course you're gonna have a marketplace where you can buy and sell heroes these heroes you're going to be able to upgrade them and sell them and trade them with other players now before we go into some dungeons let's break down the items that we have we got health potion heals a hero for 25 of its maximum health we got coins common currency for the multiverse we got evil crystals small evil crystals medium and evil crystals large consume to evolve heroes in the heroes screen so this is going to help you upgrade your heroes on the left side you can see we have guilds pvp they're great out so in the future you will be able to create your guild and of course we got the dungeon runs right here now let's go ahead into some dungeons as you can see we got the leaderboards we got progress reward and we also got rank rewards so we're gonna go ahead and hit the play button and a dungeon is going to generate now before you go into a dungeon you have to select your cards as of right now i only have five cards so i'm gonna go ahead and select my five my five cards perfect right here it's gonna cost me four energy i have a total of 60 energy so the idea is to go through the dungeons without spending all of your energy so you have to get to the boss without spending all of your energy you need energy to get to the final boss the first decision obviously is getting into the dungeon for energy right away now a dungeon is going to generate right here oh, wabam there we go easy claps so right at the beginning you're gonna be faced with a decision sometimes it's two sometimes it's three i've seen two already the first thing i'm gonna do is do treasure because i've never done it so let's go ahead and hit the treasure hidden within the ruins you find an unmarked chest loot useful items boom let's loot it there we go perfect i got some event points and some coins and that didn't cost me any energy so this is good this is a good run i have also not done any chance i don't i don't know what chance means so i'm gonna go with the chance chance a bed raggled robot accosts you in the bones outpost claiming you are the creator although not mechanically inclined you do know an opportunity when it knocks okay offer a welcome hug sure what am i gonna get oh xp there we go some event points incredible perfect now let's go into battle ladies and gentlemen all right so the wilds are a dangerous place you have been attacked i could go into normal battle and i could go into hard battle if i go into hard battle it's gonna cost me two energy i'm gonna go with hard battle here we go bam all right before we start battling let me break down the screen right here is going to be your first hero that you're going to use in the bottom you can also see what goes next so this one is the first one i can choose who i'm going to attack and of course we got affinities so depending on what type of hero you have you might want to use the strategy right here so as you can see i got the blue affinity which is probably water and i want to attack fire so i want to attack fire right away i'm blue fire boom that's probably a better attack than to attack anybody else bam 
Now on your hero, you're gonna see four attacks. This is the main attack. You're always gonna be able to attack with this one. This one is ready uh, in two turns. This one is ready when I level up to 10. And this one is my ultimate. As you can see, the bar is filling up. As the match goes on, this is going to fill up and I'm going to be able to use it. And of course, it does way more damage. I'm gonna double down on this hero and try to kill him. Bam, okay. Double down, get him out of the way, get out of here. All right, fire with fire. We actually have our second ability for this hero ready. Let's actually use that. Bam, we eliminate it right away. Holy crap, okay. Um, this one is not ready, so we're just gonna use a regular attack. Boom, wa-boom. All right, we're almost done with this hero. We're gonna get him out of the way. Easy claps, ultimate, bam. This is a pretty sick animation, let me tell you. I like how quick this game is. I like how how satisfying it is to, to click pam 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 ping boom pam. You know, you know what I mean. Now along the way, I got absolutely wrecked, ladies and gentlemen. So at least I got some experience, and with this experience, I can go ahead and level up my heroes. So the next run I do is going to be way better. It's going to be way better because I'm going to be leveled up. I'm going to be stronger. So you get stronger as you go and you kind of learn how to navigate these dungeons. Obviously, every single dungeon is going to be different, but that's how procedural dungeons work. You know, you have to learn along the way what is the best strategy. You never really know how it's going to work out. And of course, I'm pretty new at this, so I'm pretty sucky. But I will be playing this game live, ladies and gentlemen. So make sure you join me live tomorrow or today if you're watching today in the afternoon monday probably at 4 p.m eastern around that time so make sure you hit that live stream let's play this game together this is actually a really good game and it's very satisfying like i said i love how quick the battles is it's really really engaging it's a really engaging game compared to many other card games out there this is really really engaging so i really like it a lot